Hey kids, welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Hello and welcome to another episode of Wildlife Crystal. I'm your host, Wildlife Crystal, a wild animal specialist. As you know, on this show, Wildlife Crystal, we are gonna be learning fun facts about one animal and their environment every episode. I'm here with my very special co-host, the one and only, Kaya the Koala. Hello to all of my fans. How are you today? I was thinking for this episode, we should focus on an animal that has bear in the name. You know, because I'm a koala bear. Mm, Kaya, you do know that you are not actually a bear, right? You're um, a marsupial. Bear is just in your name. Ah, uh, yes, of course, I knew that. <laughs> well, I still think discussing a bear is a great idea. Well, I can't argue with that. And I have just one in mind. You guys already know it's a bear, but try and guess what kind. The bear gets its name because their hair is grizzled, meaning silver tipped. Everyone at home, try to guess too. I'll give you five seconds. That was a good hint. Is it the grizzly bear? <laughs> yes, it's the grizzly bear. <sighs> who also got their name from the word grizzly, meaning gruesome or scary. Well, they are a little scary. I mean, they are huge. That's also true. Some grizzly bears can stand as tall as 10 feet. That's taller than the tallest human. And they can weigh up to 1,500 pounds. That's more than the weight of two huge motorcycles combined. Holy cow, that's huge. Wait, they must eat animals as big as a cow, right? Oh yeah. Grizzly bears are what's called apex predators. That means they're at the top of the food chain. They hunt very large animals such as moose, caribou, and bison using their speed and strength to catch them. Grizzly bears are also omnivores, which means they eat both plants and animals, and are opportunistic eaters, which means they will eat almost anything that they can find. These bears will forage for berries, dig in the sand for clams, eat grass, and go fishing in the rivers. Oh yeah, I've seen cool footage of grizzly bears catching fish in midair who are swimming upstream. Definitely worth a Google. That is super cool to watch. Every year, grizzlies gather to fish for salmon that are swimming upstream to mate. As many as 20 bears can be seen in one spot, where they often catch salmon leaping out of the water with their paws. Are grizzly bears and brown bears the same animal? Not exactly. Grizzly bears are considered a subspecies of the brown bear. The main difference between them is their diet and geography, meaning where they live. Brown bears live mainly in coastal areas with access to marine foods, whereas the grizzlies live further inland. Grizzly bears inhabit Western Canada and the Northwestern United States. Tell us about grizzly bear babies. This is interesting. Grizzly bears start to hibernate around November. Hibernation is a way that some animals deal with the harshness of winter. They curl up in a safe place and stay there until winter ends. Midwinter, pregnant grizzly bears wake up from their sleep to give birth, but then return back to their slumber right after. Grizzly bear babies, known as cubs, are born blind, hairless, and toothless. They use what little strength they have to nestle into their mother and nurse or drink their mother's milk. For a month, the cubs feed on their mother's milk to gain strength. By the time spring comes, the cubs have opened their eyes and have grown teeth and fur. The new family is ready to venture outside of the den. The cubs stay under their mother's care for two to three years. Mother bears are extremely protective of their cubs. Oh, is that where the phrase fierce like a mama bear comes from? Exactly. Never, and I mean never, get near a cub in the wild. The mother is always nearby and will stop at nothing to protect her babies. Deal. Do bears have to eat a lot before hibernating? Yes, they do. Grizzlies can hibernate for five to seven months. They don't eat while they're hibernating, so they must eat as much food as possible beforehand. 
Bears can gain as much as 400 pounds in weight before going into hibernation. That's the weight of a lion. Whoa, interesting. Tell us another fun fact about grizzly bears. Here's a good one. The grizzly's claws are as long as human fingers. They grow up to four inches long. Oh man, that's a huge claw. Okay, tell us one last fun fact about grizzly bears. Okay. Never try to outrun a grizzly. They can run up to 30 miles per hour. That's faster than the fastest human in the world can run. Despite their large size, they can move fast. The large hump that's on their shoulders powers their fast moving front legs. Please tell me these amazing animals are not threatened. Unfortunately, yes, grizzly bears are listed as threatened. Grizzly bears are threatened mainly by habitat loss due to logging, development, and mining. Habitat loss means that humans are destroying animals' natural homes to make more room for human homes, shops, and farms. While humans need these things, we need to try to put them in places where bears and wildlife are not already living. Also, when bears are drawn close to humans, attracted by livestock or garbage and other food, they are often exterminated. Furthermore, in Canada, people hunt grizzlies for sport, which is disgusting and awful. One thing we can all do right now is to try to minimize human-bear conflicts. When living or visiting grizzly bear habitat, never feed bears or wildlife. And keep all your garbage securely contained. And of course, spread the word. Be an advocate for grizzly bears. Tell their story to your friends, family, on social media, or at school. By spreading the word, we can reach more people who can help. Remember, it's up to us, the future generation, to make sure they have a place to live. Let's all work together to make sure animals and humans live in harmony. Let's always be kind and respectful to every creature on this planet. And now it's question time. Uh, mm -hmm. Kaya, are you as excited as I am to put the knowledge we just learned to the test? I sure am. True or false? Grizzly bears are huge animals. The correct answer is true. The grizzly can grow up to 10 feet tall and weigh up to 1,500 pounds. What is an apex predator? Is it A, an animal who is slow? B, an animal who can climb well? C, an animal who is at the top of the food chain? Or D, none of the above? The correct answer is C, an apex predator is an animal who is at the top of the food chain. What is a baby grizzly bear called? Is it A, a cub, B, a calf, C, a pup, or D, a kitten? The correct answer is A, a cub. You guys did great. Kaya and I have to go, but we will be learning fun facts about another animal next week. See you next time on Wildlife Crystal. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye, guys. Toodles. See you next week. Bye.